yesterday she stepped further into the trailer today she didn't even try any further and it's probably because she knows I'm gonna give her treats anyways just for rewarding little tiny steps well today so yesterday I gave her treats to reward little tiny steps that she took and today she didn't take any extra steps we got to find a new way because today you did no advancement go on go eat your hay so go get more voices. Yeah. So basically, I, I'm stumped. Like yesterday, she's been making improvements. I double checked with my trainer because a lot of you guys said I was doing it wrong. She said, nope, you're doing exactly right. Reward for every new thing that she does. Every little step that she takes is new, that's forward, that's better. Today, she didn't take any. So today, I didn't reward at all. I just want her like, I just need like, I don't know, it's frustrating, but I'm gonna keep working on it. But anyways, welcome to a Friday. It's gonna be a good Friday. All the girls are back in lessons today. Kaylee, Paige, Gabby, Sophie, and it's gonna be a good one with Brandon. Uh, but before that, we have a whole day in front of us. Uh, the concerning thing is that it is like late now, and we still don't see Sophie. And I'll show you guys what I saw. The rule is now, I'm done at 11 and 14 saying like, you guys come on, get up, get dressed, do your hair. Like at this stage, if you, can, if you guys can't figure it out, no, I don't tell you to do your hair. I used to, um, but yeah, yeah, when you were a child, but you're not a child anymore, which is my whole point. So I'm not waking them up anymore. They know what time they have to be up. They have alarms. There's no reason why they can't get up. So I refuse to wake them up. Sophie is always up. And then I checked on her just to make sure she was alive. And I saw this. So at first I couldn't figure out what it was, but I'm pretty sure her head is under there, the pink spot. And that's her leg up in the air. I listened and listened and I'm sure I heard breathing, but she still hasn't arrived. You didn't even brush your hair. <laughs> She looks like she jumped out of bed, threw on some clothes, and ran down to the barn. Sophie. Sophie. What, what happened to you today? <laughs> what happened to you today? What? Apparently you slept in. 8.47 a.m. 8.47 a.m. Uh, yeah, almost a whole hour late. So, wait, what were you thinking when you woke up? Tracy was even with <laughs> So, what were you thinking? Did you just jump into your clothes and run down no, to the I barn? I didn't think she changed. I did change. <laughs> she just jumped in. <laughs> All right, well, I'm well, glad you're here. Welcome to Friday. Were you shocked when everybody was gone? Yeah. Yeah. You guys, Penny loves me. Remember when I had Stella and I could never tell if she actually cared about me or if she actually loved me? And she was such an affectionate, loving mare. And Penny is not an affectionate, loving mare. And yeah, I can totally tell that she loves me. She looks to me for direction. She looks to me for safety. Isn't that crazy? Girl. Willow kisses. And I tried kissing Penny and she doesn't really love it. But what Penny loves is hugging. And Penny is a hugging horse. When you when I hug her, he she likes cuddling, he likes he cuddling. Hates kisses. He hates kisses. So does Penny hate kisses. What does uh, Finn like, Sophie? Um, Finn likes people not to annoy him. So Penny, I've learned, loves to be hugged. I can walk right up to her and put my arms around her and bury. Well, she's eating right now and bury my head into her, and she digs into me and hugs me back. Yeah, girl. And it is the most amazing feeling. And also, if I do kiss her, sometimes I grab a hold of her halter 
and I stand in front of her and I make her stare in my eyes and she stares in my eyes with the most loving expression of earth. I've never felt more love from any other horse than I love than I feel from this horse. And when I first got her, you guys might remember, I was like, I don't know, like she was so grouchy, so mad at the world, so unhappy, probably from the move. And now she's bonded and she I never ever thought we would have this horse. Like I never ever thought I would have this horse. Thought I was always gonna be that girl with a grouchy horse. But now she's just amazing and she loves me. Holy cow, you guys, it's freezing out still. The sun is out and I thought it was gonna be super warm. So I just wore like a spring coat with a sweater. Too cold, too cold for that. So we were up in the house, the girls did school. And now we are gonna break out this big bad boy. So if you're new to the channel, you may never have met this big bad boy. But this is our husky tack trunk. This is what we take. Uh, this is what we take to every single show. Let's see what's in there. We haven't opened this in months. All right, so that's it. That's what's in there. <laughs> I, I washed our saddle pads in preparation for the show. Uh, the problem is, is that the, this one's kind of getting old and it's small. It doesn't really fit our horses. And so we're gonna go to the tack store, a different tack store, and buy new show pads for the show. And I'm excited. So this show pad is a really nice sheepskin one got this on Amazon so I'm gonna just double check and make sure that this one does fit our horse and then we'll just need one also we have this one that we got on Amazon and it doesn't have the fur around it so we don't use it but it's really good quality as well so I'm gonna put that one away one of our jobs the girls job is going to be to clean out our tack trunk and see what we need before tomorrow for the show. This is our Miracle Groom bottle. It's frozen. <laughs> it's got all of our braiding stuff. It's got our bug spray and our show sheen, which we do need more of. So looks like we are gonna be doing another shopping trip. It's got one of our, uh, we bought this bat recently because we needed a show bat. So uh, that is on the agenda today. What happened? We got brain damage up there. Yeah, we got brain damage. Why did you get brain damaged? I hit my head too many times on those. And I, I'm surprised nobody woke up. You were awake, obviously, with me. And I walked out to go down, check out the ponies. I hit my head, okay. Oh gosh. Let's go see. Okay. Let's go see. Okay. I'm gonna so there was a video where we slept up there. It's uh, 24 hours in the hayloft, I think it's I called. And Gabby did wake up in the night and smacked her head. There was a point in the night where I thought the ponies were climbing up these stairs. I swear they were trying to. If you're hoping for another 24 hour video, then hold on to your hats because it's about to happen. I don't know where we're gonna sleep yet, but the grandkids are coming, hopefully, as long as our COVID rules don't change. Come here, come to mama. Good girl. I don't have a treat, oh yeah I do. Good girl. Yeah, she was about to run away from Gabby. Run outside and I said run to mama and she did. Run up behind Penny here. Run up behind Penny. Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> so that's. So that's kind of an example of what I was trying to tell you. She does not like anything to run up behind her. But we're gonna fix that. We're gonna socialize her. Desensitize her, I guess is the right word. I am going to fix that in my girl. That is the one big thing I'm gonna work on this spring. Sun is coming up, are you ready to go? We can take a ride, we can take it slow. Your will is my law. I'ma let you be the boss, cause I'll go with you.
playground We are kings of the world And anywhere we slow down We are kings of the world Kings of the world And anywhere we slow down We are kings of the world Holy heck you guys Grace is like seriously not in really bad shape In the past after winter our horses come have come out fat And she's not that fat She's just a little tiny bit fat It won't be long before she's in good shape the girls are so kind, they're making a tire jump for me. What do you guys think? You think Penny and I could jump it? No. Do you think I should jump Penny? No. Ever? Her yeah, she's not a jumping horse. I feel like she's a... a you see her gallop. Yeah. You're not a, you are not a regular horse. You are not a jumping horse, are you, Penny Pickle? is free in a big field Guys, and she chose to come to me my what butt's wet. what'd you do gabby pushed me <laughs> we were training for the army all right let's see it gabby's dressed in her black army attire black is not army attire gabby's dra dressed in her ninja attire Guys, right, she's a swat team she's i am not a whole team do i look that big no. All right, here it goes, friends. This is Gabby doing her military training.
guys. I need to train for this. We'll do this again in a couple of months. And see who wins then. We'll go running every day then. I'd love to go running every day. But that's it for today's video, you guys. We'll see you back here this weekend. We have two really fun videos. Uh, we'll be hopefully with Kaylee and be making something really fun, doing something really fun with our horses, with the boys. See you tomorrow. Don't you know that you're beautiful?